Imagine an 88-year-old woman, Lu Xiaoying, lying in a hospital bed. Her frail body battling kidney failure, with her daughter tenderly holding her hand. Lu's wrinkled face tells the story of a lifetime of hardship, yet her eyes still shine with warmth and kindness. Lu had endured a tough life in China. She didn't have a glamorous job. Instead, Lu and her husband, Li Xin, made a living by collecting trash in Zhejiang province, a rural area in eastern China. They work hard from early morning until late night, searching for garbage to sell, and life was never easy for them. But amidst the struggles, what truly set her apart was her heart of gold. This extraordinary woman had a unique story. It all began in 1972, when Lu was collecting trash to support her family. She first found something in the dumpsters that certainly didn't belong there. A newborn baby girl. She was crying, sitting among the garbage, left behind and forgotten. She couldn't let her die. Despite already raising a daughter, Lu decided to adopt the baby instead of leaving her or taking her to an orphanage. It wasn't easy for her to raise her, but the joy outweighed the difficulties. From that moment on, she and her husband embarked on a journey of love and sacrifice, raising not only their own children, but also the precious souls left behind by others. Their house was a rundown temple divided into small rooms. It was neither significant nor comfortable, but it was the center of the universe for those children. They turned it into a cozy place where every child felt loved and cared for. Despite their own hardship and the lack of official recognition, Lu and her husband poured their hearts into providing for their growing family, relying on the kindness of their community to make the ends meet. Lu found more babies in the garbage. She couldn't understand why someone would abandon them, but she didn't judge. Despite being poor, she took them home and cared for them. By the time she reached her fourth rescued child, Lu realized she could no longer raise all the children she would find. As her own daughter grew up, their small house became too crowded. So she asked her community for help and found kindred spirit who shared her compassion for these discarded lives. Together, they formed a support network ensuring that no child will be left behind in the rubbish. In 1979, China made a law that affected Lu, her husband, and many others. The law said families could only have one child to control the population. The law had a big impact, unfortunately. Over time, the number of children found in the rubbish grew, but Lu never considered leaving them there. I realized, if we had strength enough to collect garbage, how could we not recycle something as important as human lives? That thought helped her save more than 30 children over 40 years. Lu's remarkable story remained hidden until 2012, when one of her adopted daughters, Zhang Juju, reached out to a newspaper for help. Lu, then 88, was battling failing kidneys and heart, and her limited income couldn't cover her medical expenses. Journalists uncover Lu's situation, finding her in the hospital bed, surrounded by her daughters and grandchildren. Among them was Sang Kilin, a boy Lu had rescued from the streets at the age of 82. Despite her own struggles and the loss of her husband, Lu couldn't bear to leave Kilin behind. She named him Kilin, meaning rare and precious in Chinese. From her hospital bed, 
Lu's thoughts lingered on Kilin's future. She dreamed to raise funds to send him to school, a dream she couldn't fulfill for her other children. Lu's greatest wish was for Kilin to have an education, ensuring he wouldn't have regrets in life after she was gone. Lu's story resonated deeply with people in China and all over the world. Generous donations poured in to support Kilin's education and Lu's medical bills. Lu Xiaoying's legacy of love and compassion continues to inspire, reminding us all of the transformative power of kindness. Her story serves a touching reminder that in the world filled with hardship and despair, love has the power to heal, to uplift, and to bring hope to even the darkest of days.